Hey beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. It's Cheyenne Marie here in the living flesh. I haven't done a video for you guys in such a long time. A video, a makeup related video. Not a vlog, but a makeup related vi video in such a long time. So, so I'm gonna give you guys today. I'm going to be featuring a few lip products from Essence Cosmetics. I did a haul with them a couple days ago. Not a haul, but I went on their website to see what they're about, and actually they're wonderful. They're free shipping on all products over, or all orders over $15, which is amazing. You can get a lot for like 20 Like I got two lipsticks, two lip glosses, a liner, like a brow liner, and I got a gel, gel, gel pen thingy. Whatever the eyebrow gels are, I don't really use them. I usually use powder, but I got a brow gel all for like $20 maybe a little bit under $20 and I got free shipping on top of that so yeah go over to Essence Cosmetics I don't know what you're doing I need to, I think you need to stop pause the video go open a new tab go to Essence Cosmetics go fill up a bag go spin the bag and then come back and then see how we can create this glam look under $20 at least the lips under $20 but the eyes, all this, all this fall vibes. I'm giving you fall vibes, y'all. I'm giving y'all fall vibes, yes. I'm gonna go ahead and put y'all on and then we can get right into the, the fall season, hot girl summer in the fall. So I'm gonna go ahead and my eyelids are already primed. When I say primed, I mean I just set concealer over them using Juvia's Place Concealer. This is the shade 11. It's my pseudo natural but highlight shade. And uh, I like to use the highlight shade on my eyes just because I feel like it'll bring out the pigment since it is a lighter tone versus using a white primer base. First things first, I think I'm going to go in with the Jackiana palette here. It's so cute in the sunlight. I'm going to go ahead and use Edges as my transition shade. I'm going to do a nice cute little green look for you guys today. Doesn't really match my, I mean it matches my outfit but something in my heart of hearts is saying use green. I'm gonna go ahead and just dot that up here. And then blend out. Once I have a nice kind of outline, then I go ahead and blend. It looks red on camera, but it's like a, it's like a, it's an orange, it's, it's an orange shade whatever whatever falls in the orange spectrum and I blend that out all right here and it looks really nice it looks really gorgeous I bring it up to the eyebrow as the transition should because you need to leave room for your crease and then your lid now for my crease I'm gonna also use the Jackie Anna palette I'm gonna go in with credit this matte dark brown shade here same brush just because I feel like it blends out easier using the same brush you applied your transition with it'll soften up the crease color and I'm going to lightly tap my brush into credit dust off the excess and then put that into my crease I start off heavy in the outer corner because that's where I want the focus mainly. I want it to be darker here and then lighter here. So this is where most of the product will be concentrated. I'm also gonna bring it to the outer corner right here of my eyelid. So when I apply my green shade, it'll just pop. It's a little bit of a darker look for a morning time or daytime look, but uh, you only live once. Go hard or go home, folks. That's today's tutorial. Pack it on, then brush. So remember, pack, you want it really concentrated, and then you're gonna brush into your crease. I'm gonna blend it back out with the uh, edges shade. Dab off the excess and then just go up and just blend over it. You see it already tones down credit. 
So using edges to lightly go back over your crease would be easier for future blending. We have to go back and blend it out anyway. So it's a kind of soft, nice, gradual blend here. Using a flat brush, not wet or anything. I'm gonna go into my Morphe Jackie or oops, Morphe Jaclyn Hill palette. I know she's canceled or whatever, but I love the palette. I love the colors within that palette. It's obviously old as hell. Pretty sure it's expired, but this green shade trickery fitting for her. But this green shade trickery is just so cute. I love it. I'm kind of Like without a wet brush, it's like it's popping. I'm apply it to my lid here. just half of my lid because right here I'm gonna darken it again with credit but half of my lid that's good go back in with the Jackie Ina palette using credit putting that to the, the corner here then blend You're gonna blend again here because that lid color and the crease is gonna kind of mesh and if you want like a seamless kind of flow between it if you want not a cut crease but you want the cleanness of a cut crease I think it's better to blend your crease color just right after you put on your your lid shade just so it it stays in its place I guess I don't know any other way to describe it so I'm gonna leave it like that that's cute as is I'm not gonna touch it not gonna do anything to it I'm so tempted to add like a gold, but I think I might use Dolas from the Jackiana palette. This like gold green shade here, shimmer. Just like lightly apply it. Oh yeah. That. That does wonders. Like, period, boo. That's cute. So, I'm gonna do the other eye off camera, and I'll be back with you guys to apply my foundation and the rest of my face. I'll be featuring some products from Essence Cosmetics. Their lip gloss, um, lipstick combos, and their brow gel. I'll be using, usually I set my brow with the powder, but I'll be using their brow gel. <clears throat> I lied. I had to hurry up and do all my makeup off camera pretty much like my my concealer my foundation just because I'm in a rush for my niece's birthday she is turning two so we're all gonna go do a train ride and have some much needed family time so that means I have to hurry up and do this for y'all I already applied my lashes as you can see these lashes are by salon perfect and I got them at the beauty uh, beauty supply store they're about like $2.99 $3.99 you know they're really really good I love them uh, they last quite a while maybe because I don't wear lashes as much but they last a decent amount of time especially if you know how to take care of lashes you know washing them removing the glue I think these have made it through at least one wash I don't know but anyways this is what these are use my foundation gonna be a hot day so I had to powder up which is why I'm looking a little bit light but as soon as I set my uh, set my makeup it'll all oxidize and come together the powder that I use would be the Maybelline fit me powder this is in the shade 30 medium deep they have it at Target I this is my second one and they last forever you guys so I already went in with my brow gel from essence cosmetics my brow gel and my brow pencil now I'm gonna go ahead and 
pick one of these gorgeous lipstick lip gloss combos and apply them. This one is in the shade C08 from the This Is Nude collection. Not sure if it's gonna. You're gonna focus or what? Yeah, no, it's not gonna focus. Shade 8 in the This Is Nude collection. This is shade 3. Then I have some lipsticks to top those off. This one is in the shade Big Softy. It's kind of like a, I don't know, I don't, I'm gonna call it like a, a tan coffee kind of color. And this one's like champagne, I call it. And this one is the shade XXL Charm. I think for this look, I wanna go on with something a little bit darker, so I'm gonna use 08. Don't think I'm gonna line my lips, but I think I might actually, might have to for this look. Ooh. I'm gonna use the Makeup Shayla ColourPop Perception Lippy Pencil. This is the shade BFF4. I'm gonna line my lips with that. Lining the lips, you can, you know, manipulate the shape. And when I mean manipulate the shape like this one here, I'm going to go back in and fix this one, but I want to kind of overdraw or overline my lips. up here when you line your lips I suggest you blot it out a bit so just kind of rub them together that way when you do go in with your lipstick or lip gloss or whatever It's not like it's not gonna blend out well. It's already pretty blended here. I could honestly leave it like this with like a liner or a, a lip gloss and be done. Ooh, Big Softy might be a purple shade. Uh oh, I thought it was like a brown. Mm. Let's see how number three looks. I might go in with number three and then use a lipstick just because eight looks a bit dark for me for this look at least so going in with just a little bit I'm gonna kind of blot it over my liner it out just a little bit you don't need a whole bunch of lipstick when you want to like add a liner lipstick and lip gloss combo or however if you want to do an ombre effect you don't have to do too much the minimum is fine I'm gonna top it off with XXL charm oh. she's really like yeah she's cute as a topper it's very sticky I feel like there's a bit of a tug to it so I'm not sure if that's going to dry out my lips. This one is Big Softy. They're both pretty clear, but their finish is... Yeah, there's a bit of a tint to it. So I don't think I'm going to use this one. I want to go in with this one. And then just apply it over. formula for the lip gloss is really thick so it's hard to get product out 
I think a perfect dupe for uh, a dupe for this one would be Makeup Shayla ColourPop's Drippin' Lip Gloss. Same color pretty much, but the brush is like makes all the difference. Plus the formula isn't as thick, if that makes sense. There you go. She's cute. Okay. She's real cute or whatever. Put my hair out. Ooh. That was a look. This. Okay, girl. I see you. Oh my god. Yeah. This is a vibe. Like. I wasn't expecting this, but I look bad, okay? Is she bad, 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 okay? All right, then. I was not expecting to slay on y'all like that, but uh, since I did, if you like this video, make sure you hit the thumbs up button. If you're not a subscriber, if you're not in the family already, I don't know what you're doing, but uh, you need to get in on this. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button down below. Follow me on my social media on Facebook and Instagram. I am Cheyenne Marie Beauty, and I will see y'all in the next video. Bye, babes.